Granted, we haven't got the goals in the first game just yet, but certainly um, Jets, it's the only game where they've dominated possession. So I know stats don't tell it, but here, it's getting a bit rough now, I'll leave it to you. Thanks, Tristan. Gonna see our first yellow card. It's gonna be issued to Lucas Moragas for blocking off that run forward of Johnny Contrombis, who has probably just got a little well done in his ear now from Alan Stadgy. Beavers puts it out. Quickly taken throw for the Jets. Piscopo. Just a slightly heavy touch and a penalty. Aquilina, as he reached for the ball, as did Beavers. And the Englishman made the connection with Thomas Aquilina. All up to their leading scorer. Apostolos to Batalopoulos. He scored from the spot against Wellington Phoenix. And fires it into the back of the net against the glory. Make that seven goals in seven games for the man with the longest surname in the competition. Do you expect any change at the halftime? Not, not to start with, uh, but we've got some exciting young players, so looking forward to it. Yeah, best of luck for the second half. Thank you. Well, you've got to change now because Adam Taggart has equalised against his former club. An absolutely brilliant finish inside the penalty area. Glory streaked away down the right-hand side. And Adam Taggart fairly thumped it into the roof of the net. Now, causing the Jets many more problems as a result. Oh, goodness me. Cheap giveaway. Stefan Kolakowski! 2-1! What a turnaround for Perth Glory! Within 10 minutes of the restart. And Stefan Kolakowski reborn under Alan Stajic after a miserable campaign last time around, has his third goal of the season, and two of them have come against the Jets. But what were they thinking, Newcastle? Kanka. Moragis in behind, squares it up, surely! There's the equaliser, Trent Bahaja! In the 97th minute! Spares Newcastle's blushes, and it's 2-2, and it is heartbreak for Perth Glory. With virtually the last kick of the game, Newcastle conjure up an equaliser through their substitute.